what's going on guys let's look at this problem right here this question is asking a conducting bar slides without friction on two parallel horizontal rails that are 65 cm apart and connected by a wire at one end the resistance of the bar and the rails is constant and equal to 0 0.08 ohm a uniform magnetic field is perpendicular to the plane of the rails a 0 0.08 newton parallel to this to the rail is required to keep the bar moving at a constant speed of 0 0.6 meter per second what is the magnitude of the magnetic field okay here the question is asking us to find out the magnitude of the magnetic field but before we do go for the question let's note down the given information here we have the separation of these two bars that is given by 65 centimeter so let's say l l is equal to 65 centimeter and also we have the resistance that is 0 0.08 ohm and then we have the force force is equal to 0 0.08 newton and we have the speed that is 0 0.6 meter per second now here we are going to use these equations if you remember Faraday according to Faraday's laws EMF is equal to BLV and also we know that F is equal to ILB and also we know according to Ohm's law we know that V is equal to IR so in this case EMF EMF is equal to IR okay so here the question is asking us to find out the magnetic field and if you look at the question we have the force also right now we can use this equation because we don't have EMF and uh, we have this speed and this one but let's see which one we can use let's deal with this one f is equal to ilb and f is equal to ilb and here we don't have the current so we can replace this current with this one instead of this we can say i is equal to emf divided by r from that one we can create the equation instead of i we can put emf over r so this is going to be emf over r times lb and if you look at this question we don't have the emf also right so instead of EMF, we can plug this one. This is BLV. So this is going to become BLV times LB divided by R. And if you simplify this one, this is going to be B square L square V divided by R. That's going to be equal to F. From this one, we can derive the equation for B. B is the question, right? So we, can, we have to write this one in terms of B. And if we rearrange this equation, that's going to be B square is equal to f times r divided by l square v now since we are trying to find b let's take square root square root both sides if i take square root this side this is going to become f r l square v under the square root now let's go ahead and plug the values here we have the force that is 0 0.08 0 0.08 and that one multiplied by the resistance resistance also 0 0.08 0 0.08 then l square is the separation that is 65 65 times 10 to the power of minus 2 because i'm converting this centimeter into meter so 65 times 10 to the power of minus 2 square times the velocity that is 0 0.6 and that's it if you calculate this one you will get 0 0.15890 and in two decimal places this is going to be 0 0.16 tesla and that's our final answer I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.